Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, as you can tell from the title of this video, today we are going to be trying out Pretty Little Thing prom dresses. So I went onto the Pretty Little Thing website and literally just typed in prom and these were the dresses that came up. I ordered about seven or eight, I think. And in this video, I'm basically just gonna be trying them all on, reviewing them for you and just telling you if they're worth the money or not. Obviously prom season is coming up depending on whether proms actually go ahead obviously because of the virus so hopefully if they don't go ahead when they are usually supposed to it will just be postponed to a later date so I hope this video is still helpful for anyone looking for a prom dress I know prom dresses can be super expensive and these ones are not expensive so if you are looking for a prom dress on a budget then this video might be interesting for you also if you've not got a prom and these dresses I thought personally are very appropriate for if you've got like a wedding if you're looking for a party outfit like a little bit of a nicer party Party outfit or if you just want to have a nice dress for the summer if you're going on holiday anything like that by the way please excuse my hair um you know one of those ones where you put it in a plait overnight and then it comes out a little bit more crazy than you expected yeah that's what happened to me today so please ignore the bush that is my hair this is the huge bag of pretty little thing outfits that i managed to pick up just as a little kind of disclaimer i did get this video idea from roxaurus Roxasaurus, I believe that's how you say her YouTube name. I will leave her video linked in the description box just because I got inspiration from her video to film this video. So yeah, without further ado, I'm just gonna show you the items that I picked up. So the first dress I have to show you is this cute little kind of neutral peachy pink skater dress. So this is obviously a short dress. I haven't actually got that many short dresses in this haul. I think I've only got like maybe two or three. The rest are longer dresses. But I did want to include a short dress in this kind of prom trial because I know some people really like to wear short dresses for prom. This one is in a really nice thick scuba material and it's also, as you can see, it got these cute little kind of ruffle details around the kind of front of the dress. So it almost looks like, it reminds me of kind of like a tulip or like a flower that's kind of like coming up along your chest. This I picked up in a size four and it does fit me completely perfectly. I wouldn't have picked another size. This is literally my perfect size it's definitely kind of hugging me around the waist and it's just the perfect length as well I will say it is a little bit itchy around my kind of top bit here and also the waistband it's that kind of material where it's just a little bit itchy in certain areas but it's nothing crazy I actually really like this one I think it's really cute and pretty and if you're not going to prom this would be a really nice dress to wear if you've got like a wedding if you're a wedding guest or something like that that would also be a really nice dress to wear so this is the dress just a little bit more up clothes it feels really good quality actually I really like the material of this it keeps its shape really nicely and yeah this one is a really cute dress okay so this is dress number two and as you can see this one is a black velvet kind of sweetheart neckline dress with a big front slit this one is completely maxi length as well so this one goes all the way to the floor and it is actually quite long for me I've even put heels on with this but it is still a little bit long so it's kind of like draping on the floor at the back which some people might like for me personally I find that element to the dress a little bit annoying and I feel like a lot of people would as well just because you can catch it on your heels quite easily especially if you're wearing stilettos which is just something to sort of note with this one this one I picked up in a size at four as well and I actually do really like the kind of concept of this dress I really love the sweetheart neckline and we do also have some boning in the front of this so it has got the bones that kind of keep it in its shape so that it's not going to kind of get all distorted throughout the night my issue with this dress is with the split because I'm not gonna fully show you because I don't want my private parts to be on the internet but this split literally goes all the way up the dress literally it stops at my belly button so I can literally touch my belly button through this dress which is not ideal because any little gust of wind in your vagina is literally going to be on show so that is definitely something to note with this kind of dress because for me personally if I'm going out to prom or on a night out or wherever it is I'm going to be wearing this dress I would just be worried that I'm gonna you know slip out or like I'm gonna get out of the car funny or sit down funny and then everything's gonna be out on show. I'm gonna come a little bit closer as well because just want you to see it's a little bit ill-fitting around my kind of bust area. As you can see here there's a little kind of excess fabric and we also have this little kind of weird 
bit it's just kind of like hanging on the top there I don't know if you can see that but yeah it is still really cute and I do really like it I just personally wouldn't pick this like for my prom night if I was going on one okay so this is dress number three and as you can see this one is a bright red maxi length dress this has a big slit down the other side this time and this one actually is an okay kind of length it doesn't go up past my kind of underwear line so I don't actually mind the kind of split kind of level of this dress this dress out of the two that I've tried on so far is actually the one that feels kind of the worst quality like the material of this feels very lightweight and very kind of summer appropriate but it does actually feel quite cheap and I personally wouldn't recommend this one for prom because it's quite ill-fitting as well like I don't know if you can see but around kind of this booby area here I haven't got the biggest of boobs let's not lie but even still this dress is a size four so you would have thought it'd be a little bit smaller around this kind of area we have a lot of excess fabric here and the dress is just way too long for me even with heels on I am five foot five just for reference but even with heels on this dress is still draping on the floor like if I was to wear this out I just no, I'd fall over. This is what it looks like at the back and these straps aren't adjustable so you can't like pull it to make it tighter. It's just kind of a little bit loose and floppy and yeah it just doesn't really fit that well. I just feel like out of all of them that I've tried so far this one feels the most cheap and also is the most kind of ill-fitting out of the other two so yeah I probably wouldn't recommend this dress unfortunately. Right so this is dress number four and as you can see this one is more of a tight bodycon number. It's obviously this really bright kind of yellowy orange colour which I actually really like for more plain dresses because it's the colour that kind of speaks for itself like the dress is quite plain but Obviously it's quite a nice bright colour so you'll still stand out in a crowd. This has this kind of one shoulder detail which I actually really like. I think this is more of a kind of smart option. I don't know if I would necessarily wear this to prom as such but if you was looking for a tighter dress and you didn't want something long and you didn't want something kind of skater then this is a really nice kind of style. It's got a really nice kind of shape to it at the back so it really kind of hugs you in in all the right places. It's just got a straight kind of back and then obviously you can see where the sleeve goes over as well I picked this one up in a size 4 and it fits me absolutely perfectly I wouldn't have changed the size at all and yeah I really really like this dress I think I'll actually be keeping this dress and wearing it to like a wedding if I have one or something like that because I think it will come in really handy and its colour is also really nice for summer as well so yeah this one is definitely a winner this is the next dress and this one again is black and this one is kind of like a high kind of halter neck style dress with a kind of bit that goes around your neck and then it has the two kind of straps at the back so it's not completely backless it's got these nice thick straps that kind of cross over at the back which I really like this one is a maxi length dress and I really hope you can see but it's also a kind of fishtail style so very slightly at the bottom it does kind of flare out into a mini fishtail it's nothing crazy but it definitely is a kind of fishtail style I really like this way this one fits again I got this in a size 4 and it fits perfectly it's all tight in all the right places it kind of is nice as well because it goes a little bit more tight around your bum and then it flares out but yeah this one is a really lovely kind of more understated dress I feel like the shape of this dress is really quite dressy but then obviously the color is black so it's a little bit more kind of subtle in that sense I feel like if you did your hair really nice in kind of like a bun or an updo or if you just like accessorize this correctly this could look really really nice for prom so this one is definitely a winner the only issue I have with this dress which is the most random thing ever is it smells funny like this has such a weird scent I can't explain it it's like a moldy kind of damp scent I don't really know why this dress smells like that if it's been like left in the warehouse for too long or something but I'm definitely going to be sending this one back just purely because it smells weird and even though I could just wash it I just feel like I don't want it because it just smells a bit weird which is so random I'm sure not all of them will smell like that if you order this dress but yeah other than the scent of it this dress is actually really really pretty and I really really like this one okay so this next dress dress is definitely the worst one of the bunch so far this fits me so badly this is literally unwearable like I would not be able to pull this off at all and I don't really know how anyone would because this dress has just got so much excess fabric at the front it is unreal it was supposed to be a kind of like tighter fitting around the boobs it looked like on the model anyway and then it was supposed to go down into this kind of cowl style back which I actually really love the way this dress looked on the model in fact I was 
probably most excited to try this dress on because if this looked how it did on the model I would have definitely been keeping this but this has just not lived up to expectations like there's just way too much fabric around the sides it needs to be a lot tighter kind of here there is just so much excess fabric I don't know if you can see but there is literally just too much fabric all around here it just doesn't really work it's just not fluttering at all it just isn't a good dress to be honest it's just not working it's just not working for me okay so this is the last dress that i have to show you and as you can see this one is this kind of royal blue it's kind of like a slinky kind of satiny material if that makes any sense dress i personally hate this i feel like it is doing the most and it's doing too much like we don't need these splits to be again coming all the way up to our belly button this one is even worse than the last one in terms of the split the splits are so high that any foul move and again you're on show your whole privates are on show even if you wore like little shorts with this you would probably still see the shorts like here so i just don't know how you would wear this you'd have to literally tape it to your yourself but that's not going to be very convenient for when you need the loose so I don't really know how you would wear this and not flash I just feel like it literally looks like you've just got a nice satin blue dress and someone's got some scissors and just gone like that and just cut it up and um, so this one is definitely a pass it does also feel a little bit more on the kind of cheap side I like the high neck and I like the way it feels across like my boobs and the back of it is quite nice as well but yeah definitely not be keeping this and I definitely wouldn't recommend it for prom because it's it's just not it's just not very practical to be honest is it right so that is it for today's video guys please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and do let me know in the comments if you like this style of video and i can definitely film some more for you please also subscribe if you haven't already that would be amazing thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye